guys, it's Emmy, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for this week's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my school makeup routine. Now, I don't do this every day. I just decided to include it in the title. But on special occasions, like the first day of school, picture day, I would do this. That is because I don't like to wear makeup a lot. I like to stay on the natural side and not on the glam side. I did this video last year, and a lot has changed. So I'm going to be redoing it this year. Don't mind my hair. I decided not to do it because I'm trying not to do heat to it but if you're new to my youtube channel and you enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to become part of the Eminem family I think that's enough said so let's get started here is my bag it just says just add lipstick on the other side it says Victoria's Secret I just have everything inside here it's already halfway through the day so I'm kind of gonna regret doing my makeup right now but normally on online school I don't do makeup because I'm not seeing anyone so why would I want to ruin my face you know because I feel like makeup kind of breaks me out so I just like to stay away from it or do only a little bit so starting off I use the born this way concealer by Too Faced it's in the shade warm beige I love this concealer I mean I've only tried this concealer but it's my favorite this was my first bottle and I haven't gotten a new one since which is probably disgusting but I barely wear makeup so I think it's fine sometimes I add primer sometimes I don't I don't really see a difference with primer if I do use it then I use the elf one but not gonna use it today normally I focus on my eyes I just add a couple dots to both sides like four or five then I add a dot on the eyelid itself then I also go on my chin and on my forehead and my cheek and my cheek and then my nose just so that the color is throughout my whole skin then I take this BS small face angled brush I got this off of Amazon this is how it looks like then I also take a damp beauty blender and blend it after I go in with my brush I know some people don't like blending in with a brush but I actually really like it it goes on smoothly this shade is also my exact skin color so it doesn't like brighten up my face it just evens it out then I take my beauty blender and go over it just so that there are no brush streaks guys i actually did not wet this fun fact i was too lazy to wet it this other concealer is born this way once again and it's in the shade light this is my sister's concealer as you guys can see totally different shades but since this one evens out my skin if i want to brighten up my eyes then i will use this one it has a smaller applicator i'll just put a tiny dot my eyes are so dark to begin with so i don't know if there's a difference but there's that Hi guys, I just wanted to pop in and say that today's video is actually sponsored by Luminosity LED Lights. They sell LED lights on Amazon and they recently launched their brand. I have a 15% off promo code for you guys and it is YTME15. This gives you 15% off. This promo code applies to both 32.8 feet non-waterproof and 32.8 feet waterproof products. I have the links to their other sizes for their LED lights down in the description box as well. As you guys know, LED lights have been really popular so I definitely suggest checking out their website. It is super easy to set up these LED lights and you can literally place it anywhere around your room. Thank you Luminosity for sponsoring this video again and now back to the video. Sometimes I do this, sometimes I don't. I don't really see a purpose in this but I take this Laura Mercier translucent powder. I take a different beauty blender and I dab it in here. I think it's called you set. You set your under eyes I think. I don't even know what it's called. I don't know if I'm doing this right but I'm just gonna do what I do. I know this is, is this to get rid of like oil spots? I don't even know what it's called. <laughs> I don't do makeup, so sorry, I don't know a lot. Then I let that sit for a while and I take this e.l.f. fluffy brush. I don't know, got it from Ulta. And I just spread it all over my face, make sure that the powder is gone. My favorite makeup product is mascara. Then I really like blush and highlight. Those are tied for second, but that's only what I really like to do. So for blush, I use either two different things. I use the Glossier Cloud Paint in Puff. I love this, it's a perfect color. This one is the Morphe X Maddie Ziegler Peach Out Blush, and it's a cream blush again. I actually haven't tried this, so today will be my first time trying this. Since this is my sister's, I wanna get one of my own. I might put a little bit on my nose, or I don't know. Sunburn effect. 
I have three different things that I use for highlight. It just depends on the day. The first one is this Fenty Beauty one. It's the Hustla Baby one. Looks like this. It came in a mini set. I use this only for my inner corner just because it's very bright. The next one I use is the Halo Scope by Glossier. I love this one. I use this on my cheeks and my nose because I love how this one looks. It's very glowy and natural. And then some days I would just use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in Sun Dip. And I would go into Moonstone for my cheeks and Summer for my eyes. If I do use the Anastasia, then I would use my Sephora Pro Highlight 98 brush. I actually will do one side. I don't know if you guys can tell just because of the lighting. I don't know. And then I just blend it with my finger. I just go in with my finger and dab it. And I put it on my nose. You guys probably can't tell the difference. The next step I do is mascara. So you guys know my favorite is the Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. If you guys have watched me for a while, you know my other favorite one is the Benefit Bad Girl Bang. I do not have that at the moment, so I'm using my L'Oreal Paris Telescopic Mascara. I'm using that one until it runs out, and then I'll get a Benefit one. But I just take an eyelash curler and curl my lashes. I also don't really do anything to my eyebrows just because they're already dark. I just need to get them touched up because they're looking kind of rough. Sometimes using this one they kind of turn into spiders so I try to be careful. That was only a couple coats. Normally I do more. This is a good applicator for bottom lashes which I love. People tell me my eyelashes are long but I don't do anything to them. I don't wear a lash serum. I kind of want to test one out. We'll see. Then I take the BS Small this dual brush. I use this side to brush out my eyebrows and then kind of shape them I guess. My eyebrows Eyebrows are good while like going straight, but then once it goes down, it kind of looks weird. Now I'm taking my BS Mall Brush. It's this one. It's for inner corner highlight. And I'm going to take my Fenty highlight and put it on my inner corner. I don't want to overdo it because I know I see some people who overdo it. Lastly, I wear some lip gloss. Normally, I wear the Glossier lip gloss and it's just the clear one. I want to get the red one and a new clear one because this one is almost out. But since I use my sister's Morphe cheek blush, I'm going to use her lip gloss. This is the Peach Pucker one. I'm gonna take this and put it on my lips. I have a mirror here once again. I love lip gloss and that's all I do. That is my makeup. I definitely started doing more this time around than I did last year. This is as most as it gets. I will try to leave a link down below to the brush set that my mom purchased off of Amazon. If you made it up to this point, comment down below, puff because that's the color. Stay tuned for Sunday's video when the giveaway winner is announced. If you haven't checked out my last video, you definitely should because I'm holding a giveaway. I think that's it. So I will see you guys on Sunday. Love you, babes. Peace. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something better.